What to do, my baby boos, and welcome back to my channel for another episode of Let's Play The Sims 4 Runaway Teen Pregnancy. So we are starting the day off at school. Um, I did not realize that today is spirit day. I mean, it seems to certainly be. She has the munchies. Why don't we try and really fast grab a fruit? I don't think we're gonna be able to make it though. Yeah, she's gonna just hurry off to her class. So maybe we'll just get a fruit after class. I don't know. Yep, the bell starts ringing. It's time to go. So yeah, I guess it's spirit day. <laughs> everyone is wearing blue and orange. Really everyone except for my friends and I, cause I decided to uh, go ahead and change them out of their spirit clothes because I just don't feel like those kids would even do that. Oh my God, is everybody going over to the second classroom except for me? What in the world is going on? Oh my God. Okay, my mod might be freaking a little bit because everyone is loading up into the second classroom right now. Absolutely everybody. <laughs> This is supposed to be class two, right? Why am I gonna be the only one in this in this first classroom? That's janky. Attend social studies, please. I mean, even if we're the only ones, that sucks. I don't know if you guys recognize this teacher, but this is Mrs. Clark or Miss Clark. She isn't married, but this is Becca from the university pack. So I figured she's a little grown up now and she graduated college and now she's pursuing being a teacher. Wow, really, we're the only only ones. We're literally the only ones. Oh, we acquired the archaeology skill. That's handy. Salvadoradian culture skill acquired. Okay, so we're learning about archaeology. That's cool. Morning class ends in eight minutes. Awesome. Because honestly, I, this is so, this is taking me out of the experience. Why is this mod like this? Okay, be friendly with a faculty member. I guess we can meet Mrs. Clark and like ask her. Do we have like questions we could ask her? I wonder, we'll be friendly. Is there like a teacher thing? Yeah, I guess we'll just be um friendly introduction. Okay, but I wanna make it to lunch, so hurry it up. Is anybody coming downstairs? Let's see, is anybody? Oh no, people are still in their classroom. Bruh, <laughs> this is bad. <laughs> is no one gonna go to lunch? Be friendly with a student. Well, can we all go to lunch then? Damn. So I wanted more kids to come to class, but I guess in doing that, I completely broke school. <laughs> I don't know. I guess we're hungry though. So maybe we can find something off the vending machine. Next time she goes to school, I guess I'll just take that mod out. Oh, there we go. Some kids are coming down. Okay, good. We decided that we're gonna go ahead and tell Ivan and, oh girl, why are you walking through walls? She wanted to tell, oh, there's Ivan and Millie. She wanted to tell her friends that we've decided that we would like to actually, oh, she's attracted to somebody, that we would actually like to, oh, she likes him. We'd actually like to start a band. We would like to, to do the band. We have nothing else to do. I mean, really we need to be like focusing on our baby, but you know, she's still a high schooler and she just, she wants to do something for herself too. So, and I don't, I don't see anything wrong with that as long as she's also prepping for the baby as well. Why don't we just get a pepperoni pizza roll up? It's 10 simoleons, but I don't see the lunch lady here, so kind of sucks, but <laughs> we will just have to do what we've got to do. Can we uh, introduce ourselves to Jamari? Can I just do a friendly introduction with him? You're cute, <laughs> and I'd like to get to know you. I mean, I she's definitely not gonna try and get into a relationship or anything. I think he's a football player, if I'm not mistaken. But um, she really just wants to, I don't know. She wants to meet new people, ask about his day. <laughs> Broke up, are you okay, Tasha? I knew you two were head over heels for each other. What? Did she tell him about the breakup? Why do I have so many broken hearts here? Painful memory, oh, she's talking about her breakup. Girl, that's not how you meet somebody. You just depress the shit out of him. Girl, come over here and sit down. We're not gonna be meeting people if you're gonna just be chatting their ears off about your relationship, okay? Where's our roll up thing? Where's our pizza roll up? I don't know what happened to my pizza roll up. I'm actually a little irritated because that was 10 simoleons that I can't get back. Oh, this is where everyone's been getting their food. Okay, so they've been going to this food truck. I guess I can try to haggle. This is really annoying because I purchased something already and it just, it took it right out of my freaking 
price thing. Oh, honey. Okay, we need to stop talking to people. We need to stop chatting. <laughs> Girl, we need to we need to go eat. Now lunch is less than an hour. Okay, what are we gonna order here? Oh, right, you wanna haggle. Please, please. Man, are you serious? She's like, feed hungry kids where? No. Are you crazy? I'm already losing money at these prices. You don't even own the food. All right. All right, lots of tea. Ew, crickets. Popcorn crickets. Oh my God. Ew. <laughs> I'm not eating any food. I, I mean, any crickets. Um, I may as well literally just eat popcorn. Where is everyone getting like the pizza and stuff? And we only have, we don't have like a snack vending machine. We have fruit and you know, whatever comes from here. And then we have drinks. So I mean, why don't we just say buy a fruit and we'll just get a salad. Cause like, this is just, I'm like jumping through hoops just to get her to eat a little bit. All right, come on, hurry up. Please hurry. You have literally 30 minutes, less than 30 minutes to buy this and eat it. Just eat it right there. I don't even care anymore. <laughs> Where is her friends? Ivan's over here. Maybe we should like talk to Ivan and, and tell him, you know, I am interested in doing a band with him. Ask about his day. Just be like, so by the way, oh crap. Hurry before you have to get to class. By the way, Ivan. Oh, and he's walking away. Well, we'll tell him after school. It's fine. I think after school, we are actually going to go to his house. Now you have to go to the bathroom and we have to go to class. So that sucks. <laughs> So she has language arts today. Okay, and then this should be the last class of the day and then we can start talking to our friends again. Everybody just piles into the second classroom and I, what, I'm guessing I'm gonna have to go to the first one again, alone, by myself. Just me and Miss Clark. Just me and Miss Clark. I actually had a relationship with a teacher like this before in high school. Like I didn't have any friends. I was new at the school and I needed somewhere to study. So she was like, well, you can come into my classroom and study here. And it was fine. And we had some deep conversations and I was the weird kid who had a relationship with my teacher. Not like a relationship, but like I actually really enjoyed her company and she enjoyed mine. So anyways, enough of me exposing my loserness. Can we check social bunny? She's just gonna like pretend and you know that she's not looking at her phone. I ordered a chicken and egg online. I'll let you know which comes first. Okay. Tasha, fun fact, cow plants always get left out, which is why they suffer from severe oh moo. What? I don't I don't know, but I'm just going to laugh cuz I love her. <laughs> we'll just we'll just pretend it was funny. I love that you actually gain real skills when you go to school too cuz that could help with applying for colleges. Oh my goodness. Oh, all right. Okay, so we're we're in here. All right, Ms. Clark, give me the deets. Give me the deets. Hopefully I get some like writing skills or something from being here. Can we hurry it up, please? Okay, school is over. The teachers have collected homework and dismissed. Oh, Yasmin wants to buy some, not from school. Are you crazy? Some Sims are still hanging around, but everyone is free to head home. After noting how students performed on their homework and in class, here's how everyone did. Tasha turned in some good work and took some good notes today. Hey, prom is coming. Woo! The dance takes place on Saturday evening at Copperdale High School Auditorium. Dinner will be served at the venue and the students are excited about the big night. Here are some ways to prepare. Create a promposal sign at someone to prom, ask someone to prom as friends. That's probably what we'll do. <laughs> Prepare your formal outfit. See you there. Ooh, we gotta buy a prom dress, but she has like no money. But luckily it's Tuesday, so maybe we can make a little bit of it before, you know, the big night. So I really want to, wow, everyone's just still sitting in class. Where's Millie? Okay, Millie's right here. I did control Millie for a second and I wanted to look at her sim profile for Ivan and she has a major crush on him. It's so funny. We're gonna ask her about her day, I guess. In this, we're basically telling her, okay, we're we're gonna we're gonna do the band. So yeah, I guess we're just gonna meet Ivan. Oh, she's gonna go to the bathroom first. I guess we're gonna meet Ivan at his house after school, which should be now. Girl! <laughs> Are you stinky now? Oh my God, she stinks. Okay, we're gonna have to take a shower at Ivan's house. I know this that's janky as hell, but like I don't wanna stink around my friends. Oh my God, like it's really, really carrying. <laughs> She walked all the way up to the upstairs bathroom just to wash her hands. And she did it for a second. Oh my God. I'm just gonna go over to Ivan's house and we're gonna start our band practice. Okay. 
Okay, we got to Ivan's house. What in the world? Okay, so I guess Ivan drove us here in his car. This is Ivan's car. It's so nice. Um, Me and Millie probably had to share a seat or something. It's only a two-seater, but this is his dad's car. He lives with just his dad. What is he doing? <laughs> Like telling us a big story. Ask about drug quality. Be like, so how good is the stuff that you have? And can I eat? <laughs> He's like, sure, girl, help yourself to anything in the house. Thank you. <laughs> so I'm going to get something quick. Just a quick meal. I still have to pay for it. That's stupid. We'll get a... I guess we'll just get an apple. It's two simoleons, whatever. Tasha has learned that Ivan is a high school student at Copperdale High School. No shit. That's how we met Ivan. Oh gosh, she's so angry. Why is she so mad? Fury of the trolls. Some people can be so mean. Oh my goodness. Can we all go in here and just start jamming? So this is Millie's station. This is Ivan's station. And Tasha, when she's not playing guitar, can record songs through here. And then Ivan will mix and master here. So I think it's going to be a lovely little setup. Before we start going through it, let me go ahead and open a social bunny. Gross. Can this cafeteria food look any worse? You didn't even get any cafeteria food. But yeah, that's actually true because like she was talking about the dang, you know, the crickets and the bugs and stuff. Never, never will I force my sim to eat a bug. <laughs> never. Tasha, have you thought about taking up guitar? I think you'd crush it. Um, duh. Duh, that's my thing. You already know this, Ivan. Maybe before we do band practice, I'm gonna have her go take a shower in his in his shower. He has his own bedroom with a private shower and it's so cool. I love his room so much. And yeah, like I said before, he sells on the side. So he's got all the stuffs to sell. So she's gonna go down there. Maybe I should control Millie too. Millie, where art thou? I think I saw her go upstairs actually. Why is she upstairs? Girl, why? Why are you talking to his dad? There is no reason to talk to his dad. Come here, we're gonna control you. She is so flirty. You're not flirting with him, are you? Crush nearby, oh no, her crush is definitely Ivan. Yes, okay, let me go ahead and open the sim profile real quick. So she thinks he's very attractive and her first impression is that he's her crush. His first impression is that she's funny. I don't know if he likes her like that, but we shall see. Where's Ivan? Okay. He's in the kitchen. She is gonna follow him around like a little puppy dog, okay? So why don't we, ooh, we could join in cooking. Oh, don't declare your love. We're not even really that strong friendship wise. So maybe we could uh, discuss favorite band. There we go. There's a good discussion to have with your actual bandmate. So after that, um, I wanna meet in the garage. Oh, she's still so mad. Okay, how are your needs right now though? She's a little tired and a little hungry still, but that's fine. <laughs> We're just gonna go in here, all right? I'm gonna have her sit here. We're gonna have Millie sit here. I'm actually gonna control Ivan too <laughs> to make this easier. He's hungry. He had like a snack though. He was cooking. Oh, there's his snack. Whoops. Well, go ahead and grab it then, I guess. And um, I'm gonna have you sit at the keyboard and then we're gonna start coming up with a game plan for what we're gonna do with our band and what we're gonna call it and all that stuff. So is Tasha on her way? She is indeed. She's so mad. Like, girl, you don't need to be this angry. Shoot. She is mad though. We had to waste so much money at school just to barely be fed. Like I can imagine that would be very frustrating. So what are you gonna do with Millie here? Chat with her? Okay, that, that, that's fine, but can we chat here? Like sit and chat here. We wanna come up with a band name. That's our like first, first thing is first, okay? Where is Ivan going? Okay, he's gonna, he's gonna chat with us. Okay, so what we're doing right now, she's so mad. Um, We're gonna go ahead and make a band group. So create a club and, ooh, this is perfect. Do we have anything else? Oh, we could do that too. Yeah, let's do this. And I'm gonna call this band Llama Sick. <laughs> I don't know, I, I, I came up, I went to a band generator online and this was what came up. Um, if you guys have any other ideas for band names, let me know, I can easily change it. But yeah, for right now, we are Llama Sick, okay? Our punk rock band that we started in Ivan's 
garage. And it's not an open invitation. It's invite only. And we want to add, why does only Ahote and Millie come up? I want Ivan and Millie. Millie, Ivan. Okay, there we go. Requirements, no, but we are going to do activities. We are going to produce new track. We can sing. That works too. Play guitar. Or we could just, yeah, play instrument. Play an instrument. There we go. I guess we could listen to music too. All right. So our do's are produce a new track, sing, play an instrument, and listen to music. And then I don't think we're going to have any don'ts for now. So we're going to confirm that. We are officially a band. Congratulations. Willie was accepted. <laughs> Willie. <laughs> Millie was accepted into Lama Sick. Ivan was accepted into Lama Sick. Tasha has successfully created the Lama Sick band. Now it is time to recruit new members. Eh. <laughs> we don't need to recruit anybody. They're going to have Millie write the songs because she's already kind of done that before. So while they go ahead and practice on their instruments, I think I'm going to have her go into Road to Fame, professional singing, write song lyrics. So we're going to go ahead and do that while these two jam out on their respective instruments. So he's going to go onto the keyboard, practice on the keyboard a little bit. She is going to go play her drums. We need focus. Focus. We need focus. Are you really gonna just write on your phone? Like that, okay. That's fine. Does this go together at all so far? Not really. <laughs> She's enraged. Oh my God, girl. It's okay. <laughs> She's writing an angry song. I just know it. Shout forbidden words. She's so mad. Can we just get rid of one, one little anger issue? Cause we got back pain. We're tired. Best friend though. You're, you're, you're around your best friend. Hey, same wavelength. Okay, I think she already just wrote a song. I think she's already done. Tasha has finished writing the lyrics for a song and has been, oh my God, what in the world? Oh, we got 400 simoleons. Tasha has earned 200 simoleons for each released songs and she has two released songs. I wanna know what the second song that was released is because she's only written one other song besides this one. I love how the dad is in here watching his son. Aw, he's like, wow, son, you're pretty good at that. Is he though? Yeah, I guess so. I think it's time that uh, we go home <laughs> or to, you know, the shelter to take care of our needs a little bit. She wrote the song. Maybe we can record it at school tomorrow or here. I don't know. <laughs> But uh, we need to practice the song before she ends up actually recording it. So that'll happen later. Oh, that furniture was uncomfy too. Tasha's music is paying off nicely. I see that. Like, that's amazing. But someone did suggest that we limit how much she gets from these royalties because it's a little bit unrealistic and easy, they said, which makes me sad because it's like, wow, you're going you're gonna to limit what I can make. But um, you might be right. But I need to figure out like how much I'm going to limit the payments by. Because as of right now, we get what? We get 400 simoleons. So maybe we could limit it to 200 simoleons. Like as if we only released one song because we did. So I'm going to get rid of 200 simoleons. There we go. It makes me sad, but it, you're right. <laughs> I only did release one song. So why am I getting paid for two? Anyways, um, we're going to go ahead and go back to the shelter. Okay, before it gets way too late, I do want to call the obstetrician just so we start getting a move on on, you know, what's really important. So I'm going to go ahead and sit on one of the beds here. So we are, you know, at least sheltered for a minute. What are her needs right now? She's still a little hungry. So I'm going to open up the soup kitchen. She's just in a bad mood overall. I think, you know, these hormones could be playing a big part of it. She's got back pain happening. Is she in her second trimester already? Because I think I put her back into her first, right? Yep. So second trimester in 22 hours. So she's not even like anywhere near full term. Okay, so let's open up your phone here and I'm gonna go here to home and call obstetrician. We need to really start thinking about the future of our baby. She knew right when she found out that she was pregnant that she was gonna wanna keep this baby. So yeah, we just wanna make sure that we are taking care of the child. Choosing the right birth method for you and your baby can be a daunting task. There are so many different options. It can be easy to get lost in the medical jargon and confused by the countless delivery practices. Which method are you considering? Surgery 
machine natural delivery or cesarean section. Definitely want to go for the natural delivery. I feel like C-section would be probably worst case scenario. <laughs> we want to definitely do the natural delivery with our drugs, mind you. I want some dang medicine <laughs> as soon as I get in there. Natural delivery is a low-tech way of giving birth by letting nature take its course. You may travel to the hospital once you're in the early stage of labor. Early labor can be unpredictable. The average length varies from hours to days. To promote comfort during early labor, you may try exercising on a birthing ball or take a walk. If you're fully dilated, you will be instructed by your obstetrician to start pushing. This late stage typically lasts about 70 minutes. Once your baby is born, they will be handed to you immediately for skin to skin contact. Aww. Go ahead and choose this option. Okay, so she chose the natural birth delivery. If she changes her mind, she can also call the obstetrician again to um, choose a different method. Okay, before we go get our food, I want to open Social Bunny because obviously something's popping off out there. It's always nice seeing you, Tasha. You never fail to put a smile on my face. Why are you suddenly being so nice to me? I'm like, I'm, I'm just going to ignore that because what in the world? Like you were the one who sent me to homeless shelter in the first place. Is someone here? Okay, so we're going to go over to the soup kitchen. Someone just got here for it. So go ahead and eat something. And then uh, I guess it's just time to go to bed. It's it's getting late. Oh, we got to do our homework. Sorry, hun. We got to do homework before bed. I know you're tired, but uh, it's got to happen. We want her to graduate. So what if we get a high energy protein plate? Would that would that make it so that she gets some sleep like she gets some more energy that would be amazing okay so let's try and do that all right old girl gave us some food it costed eight dollars we're gonna give that right back because it's free it's a soup kitchen you know what i'm saying how is it is it gonna help with your energy possibly that looks like a good ass meal too we got a boiled egg we got some greens we got some meat hell yeah talk about food groups that is not helping my energy at all by the way it's fine it's a good meal a really good meal actually especially for oh for like not cooking it yourself it's almost like a home-cooked meal pretty much all right we're going to uh fast forward okay now i need you to go do some homework what is this song lyrics we're gonna go do homework why not she's far too uncomfortable well i don't really know how to help you there <laughs> I guess you are just way too tired. Maybe we'll just go ahead and have you go up to bed and uh, do some homework in the morning. Just go uh, go ahead and go to sleep. She's exhausted. She's done. <laughs> she went through too much today. But I do want to open Social Bunny <laughs> again because it keeps going off. A pillow smack into my soul. It will take days to crawl out of this hole of sadness. See, y'all y'all need to stop talking about your pillow fights online. I'm about to delete both of you. Get off my friends list. I'm so sick of seeing your faces. <laughs> And I'm sure Maya lives with him now and like they're dating, dating. They're all official. She's like in her own head about it. Like I wonder how long they've actually been seeing each other. Man, that that's just got to suck. All right, but I'm going to have her go to bed and then we'll see you in the manana. Ew, gross. Okay, so I'm down here while she's sleeping at the club and freaking Tom Peeping is watching these teenagers dancing. It's so disgusting. He's just like standing there while they're dancing. You're so Oh, gross Tom. Okay, Tasha just woke up in a rage. She is literally enraged. Maybe she can hear the shenanigans that's going on in the hotel room <laughs> right across from her. At least she's pretty well rested. So we need to go downstairs and get some. Maybe we should uh, look into a mirror and try to calm down a little bit because I'm not trying to die right now. <laughs> so try to calm down just a little bit. At least try. And then we're going to have you go and use the bathroom too. Take an angry poop girl take all the angry poops you need oh honey so she is still in her first trimester her second trimester is in 13 hours i don't know she's just having a temper tantrum that's what it is this sim really needs to calm down it's from her rebellious trait so i'm hoping that talking in the mirror will help a little bit i can't believe people are still at this club right now like y'all y'all are gonna be so tired for school speaking of school i think i fixed it so apparently i was supposed to assign a class so hopefully the kids that I assigned into that class will be good like it'll it'll all work out hopefully I'm gonna open up the soup kitchen because uh, I do not want to order chips from the bar every morning 
<laughs> so I'm gonna add that back because I'm not trying to pay for anything. That's the whole point of a soup kitchen. You know what I mean? Who is this? Oh, it's Nancy. What are you doing in that outfit? Why don't we go over here, sit down, and do your homework while you wait for the soup kitchen to open. I should probably put chairs on these just so uh, they're a little functional at least. Okay, so while you wait for the soup kitchen, we're gonna go ahead and do our homework. We want to graduate early if possible. I know some people get the notifications or like the, the ask things to graduate early, so that should be good. Is anyone going to be opening this thing? Please, I'm hungry. I do not want chips. Okay, what? Is that our principal? Lady, are you really, are you for real? What is she doing? She's like, oh, so you're not getting ready for school then? I'm like, I'm doing my homework. Oh my God, leave me alone. Is anybody coming to the soup kitchen? Is it really not gonna work? I'm glad I pay myself back every time then. My own principal is distracting me from my homework. Just go ahead and finish it up. We'll eat at school. I don't even care right now. We have some free time so we can get some food in before classes start, so it'll be fine. Just relax, Tasha, just relax. Relax. You're enraged again? Principal really pissed her off. All right, let's go ahead and join her at school and see if this thing actually works this time. <laughs> Oh my goodness, she's so hungry. Everyone is just bundled outside, but it looks like everyone is in their normal clothes this time at least, so that's good. I'm gonna get her over here and order some food right away. Why don't we do a junior lunch again, to be honest with you? That was like the best food for the buck too. I think I'm gonna get rid of this critter thing unless you guys want me to have like bug days at school <laughs> for lunch. Oh, look at this kid. Hell yeah, playing with his football. So this is all like kids either I created or I downloaded off the um, invent or not inventory gallery, um, along with of course the students that came with the pack. The Alta Water Company has shut off your water. Well, I don't have property, so <laughs> that's fine. I know she's gonna have lots of bills to pay once she finally figures out where to live. Also, she's been getting sick of the homeless life, y'all. Like she wants her own place. She wants her baby to be born in a place where the baby will be safe. And as of right now, like the place she's staying in right now is not safe at all, not in the least. So I think today she's gonna try and figure out trying to schedule an appointment with a landlord. She heard there was this apartment that was available for, I think it was like 500 or 600 simoleons a week. And I think she she can afford that now that she's getting some royalties from her music. So go ahead and eat your junior lunch, even though it is literally 8.55 <laughs> AM. Don't eat it right there. <laughs> Go sit down at the table. Oh, she's still so mad. Girl, if you don't sit down, I'm gonna open up Social Bunny, see what's going on. Maya is talking about pillow fights again. I think she knows at this point that she's like trying to stress me out. And honestly, I'm I'm starting to get over a Hote. Like I, whatever, it's his loss. You know what I mean? It's just that like, we wish that our baby's father would want to be part of our baby's lives. Maybe one day, maybe we can figure out like a DNA test and maybe he'll, be all aboard after that. Tasha, we've been trying to reach you about your refrigerators. Like, ha ha, Millie, very funny. She's so met still? I thought you were very focused. Wait, please tell me we brought our homework with us. Okay, good. It's not even fully complete though. So why don't we do the rest of our homework while we wait for free time to be over? Get off your phone. <laughs> I literally, I downloaded a mod so that they would get off their phones like so often. Like I have history legacy and I have zombie apocalypse and two Sims are about to be teens in those series. And I just don't need them on their phones. You know, I wish there was like a working mod that actually made it so that they just stayed off of it altogether unless I told them, you know? Girl, if you don't put that homework on the table and do it. Oh man, see, we ran out of time cause you were busy dawdling. Okay, hurry up and finish. Ah, okay, there it is. There's the bell. Go to class. So hopefully everyone will be in the same class. Uh-uh, uh-uh. Put your dang homework in your dang inventory. Uh-uh, we're not leaving it there. Harvest Fest is tomorrow? Man, what should we do tomorrow for Harvest Fest? That was fast. Didn't we just have like vacation? Like summer vacation, like we just got back to school. Ooh, yay, people I chose are actually showing up to the class. I hope there's enough desks. Crap, I'm not gonna get a desk. Dang it, I didn't get a desk. We need a few more. We need one, two, three, four, five, six, 
seven, oh shit, eight more desks. But um, they're just gonna go ahead and sit on the floor. It's all good, guys. Just listen to what Miss Clark has to say. What are you wearing today, Miss Clark? What is this? No, just put on your normal teaching outfit that I put you in. Ooh, they're getting off the desks. Oh, I can't. I still can't. Okay. Just pay attention to what she's saying, okay? All my friends are in here, too. And my enemies. I mean, we've got her here, so. Look at Cassandra Goth. I gave her a makeover, and she's tiny. She's such a small little thing. I love her. I want to do a friendly introduction after class, though. Oh, it's already lunch. Oh, wait, hold on a sec. Oh, my God, I'm so much taller than her. <laughs> and she's in heels and I'm in sneakers. Oh, that's so cute. Okay, give her a friendly introduction, please. What was she going to do on the computer? After she introduces herself, maybe um, we can have a different band member. No, I want to talk to you. I have to be friendly with a student anyways, so friendly introduction, please please. Hi, I'm Tasha. What's your name? She's like, oh, I'm Cassandra. Cassandra Goth from the famous family. We're technically icons, but you know. Tasha's like, okay, you don't have to be full of yourself or anything. Discuss some interests and then we're going to go head off to lunch. Where? Okay, do we need to eat? Yeah, we are pretty hungry and we need some dang fun in our lives too. Let's get another, let's get a senior lunch now. Ay. Okay, we can stop talking to her now. I'm, I'm hungry, so let's go. Oh, you're sick. Wear a mask. Ask, lady. Why does she always walk through the bathrooms? It's driving me nuts. I kind of want her to decorate her locker too. Should we? What do we have here? We have goth grunge, kawaii. Hey, I heard you became friends with yet. Yeah, whatever. Preppy, sporty, anime, academia, eco enthusiast, gamer. Maybe we can do some grunge decorations because, you know, we're, we're getting into the whole grunge scene. My little one. Oh, there's something amazing growing inside of me. Oh, I told you she wants her baby not that you didn't believe me but i'm just saying like i told you she does oh wow oh that is so up her alley oh that is so up her alley we got a guitar on there we got some butterflies okay did she eat her lunch girl eat your lunch where did you put it why do you keep buying food and then leaving it someone took it grab someone else's hamburger sliders do it do it do it do it do it do it hurry hurry before they grab it because we don't want a tortilla wrapped wrapped veggie dog hurry up grab the sliders Yes. No. Dang it. Dang it, Miss Clark. I don't want to buy anything again. Eat that. Dang it. People keep grabbing their lunches. Fine. I will do a hamburger slider for four simoleons. I feel like y'all are just ri ripping me off every single day. Every day y'all ripping me off. When are you going to have this baby, by the way? Oh, shoot. Chris, you all right? All right, go eat these. An exam prep session after school today. All students are free to join us in class two's room for as long as you like. Attendance is not required, but please keep in mind that there is an exam on Friday. Make sure you're prepared. Maybe we should do that. To be honest, it's not like we have anywhere better to go. And <laughs> I don't think she's studied for this test that much yet. So I think we need to just do that. All right, so we're gonna go over to computer science class. Ayy. And also we'll be able to uh, test out classroom number two that I thought she was going to attend at least once. At least once. I wish the classes would just like, you know, alternate a little bit or something. Man, I hate getting here last. There's no seats available. Yeah, we're definitely gonna add some more <laughs> desks next time. Just go ahead and sit down on the floor. It's fine. Take notes. Yes, please do. Oh, she got one. She got her desk, y'all. Hey, look at Miss Clark. You go, lady. You teach that class. Stop with your temper tantrums. I'm done. I'm done with the temper tantrums. Okay, you did terribly today. <laughs> oh, she has a new um, programming skill. That's nice. It's already three. Okay, let's go over here and do the study. Okay, where's the study thing? It attend exam prep. Prep. I doubt anybody's gonna be going on their own accord. Well, maybe some people might. Let's see. I just, I want her to be prepared, you know? All right, let's do this. Of course, the principal's daughter is in here. <laughs> it just, it would happen that way. This is the science room. It's connected to the, the roof where they grow their own plants. Well, it hasn't happened yet, but eventually I want them to start growing their own plants. Probably around the springtime, of course, when the weather gets a little better. I can't believe freaking Harvest Fest is tomorrow. We got to celebrate with like Millie or something. Or maybe we can finally call home. Oh my God, Mr. Lewis. 
Okay, end of the day report. Tasha seemed a little inattentive in class today. She could make sure, she should make sure her class skills are up before next week. Okay, so yeah, it was definitely a good call attending this. So after the study prep or whatever, maybe we can go ahead and play with the hamster, the class hamster, since it's a science. What in the world? Are you really vaping in class right now? Are you really vaping? She's like, technically it's after school. You are inside the school. The principal is right there. You need to focus. There is a child smoking a vape right behind. <laughs> right behind your daughter. Lord, Lord, Lordy, Lordy. This prep is taking forever. Honestly, I think we can stop being so sad. I think we can, you know, things are starting to look up in our lives. I think we can start getting rid of that sadness. And now she's happy. Second trimester in two hours. Oh my God, let's push through. Oh my God, is it over yet? My God, is this until six or something? Okay, there we go, 5.30. Man, that was two and a half hours long. This girl is smoking a blunt now. She's smoking a joint. Are you serious? <laughs> like right here in school. Its name is Fluffy, by the way. Oh, sweetie. You're so cute. Oh, <gasps> shit. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. Do not die from that. Do not die from that. I tell you now. Bite sized bite. Ouch. That was just a little nibble, but it's a lot of pain. Okay, well, I'm not going to feed you a treat then. How about that? Oh, he has low attention. Maybe that's why. Maybe we should just talk to it from afar. Just don't hold it or anything. Poor Fluffy just lives in his cage and none of the students bother to give him any attention. What are you doing right now? Browse the web. Actually, maybe here is as good a place of, as ever to go ahead and check out the apartment that you were thinking about. So leave that there. All right, so after we play with the hamster or talk to the hamster. Oh, look, it just rolled over for us. After we do that, um, we're gonna go ahead and um, on our laptop, we are going to try and write an email to the what is it the the landlord of these this apartment we were looking into and it looks like we have an appointment with him tomorrow evening wait no not tomorrow tomorrow's harvest fest we should reschedule so let me put the laptop back in our inventory so tomorrow we have harvest fest and i want to go ahead and do like a friend's giving type thing with millie and ivan so we're gonna do that and then on friday we have a talent showcase cheer leading sports day we're not going to schedule an event but on friday after school we're going to go take a look at the apartment and maybe even just get it right there on the spot so that would be nice i really really need her to um get a home <gasps> oh my god her bump she has a bump now third trimester in two days wait a second is that the day of oh my god she's gonna be a big balloon during prom maybe she'll miss her junior prom should we go to her prom or should we wait until the next prom when she's not pregnant anymore or should we just go to prom and like screw what the haters have to say let me know in the comments <laughs> tasha in my hands a pillow must be classified as a dangerous object hello fighter that's her reaction to maya always talking about doing the pillow fights with a hote a hote is trying to okay you know what i'm getting rid of a hote unfriend and then also we're gonna remove Maya as a friend too because I am sick of her maybe we can um, add another friend though add to contact list oh yes let's do Jamari Cassandra anybody else Lisa James we can go ahead and add her let's, should we even add Becca let's add our teacher all right so she needs to get back and do some things <laughs> that she's got to do so I'm gonna go ahead and end this part here she's gonna go back to the shelter and kind of get all ready for everything for tomorrow anyways let me know what you think in the comments down below and i will see you all in my very next video bye loves Mwah.